Hey, what's good, you guys? This is your man, Stefan, and welcome to Shudder, a game that I'm very, very, very excited to share with you guys. Uh, it came out April of last year, which was around the time that I started my gaming channel up, but I didn't find out about it until October of last year, which was when I was doing my Halloween of Terror series in all of October. Now, this game is actually... Uh, it's a very cool game, actually. It's a horror where you play as this little, this little tiny little robot man who looks like Wally from uh, Wally, uh, where you have to go into this haunted house or a house where people were murdered and shit, and you have to take pictures for the government and shit like that or whatever company you're with and shit like that. But scary shit happens. Now, I did a video on this back in October. Like, I, I mean, I, I already said I played it, but everything fucked up and so I told myself okay well I'm gonna do a video on it but I'm gonna wait a while because I went through about 35 minutes of it and everything fucked up and I just didn't want to go through that again you know with this with the without the feeling of a fresh mind of going into a new game so I mean mind you I, I in my mind I see certain things like I remember certain things but I don't exactly know like everything like matter of fact I forgot how to even fucking operate the game like the robot because it's actually inspired by old time games such as Resident Evil you know with the tank controls and shit so it's it's kind of it's taking it back you know uh, a, a, a fucking uh, what are they called yeah it's, it's just it's going back to the old style gaming man um, I'm gonna keep editing at a from non-existent to a minimum low so uh, just enjoy you know sit back this is gonna be my next official let's play uh, might be long as fuck but it is what it is man so leave a like comment subscribe and let's get with the first part man I'm actually very fucking excited to play this game enter the puzzle horror okay Press E to open computer. Okay. We need you to monitor our client's cabin with our Raven Shield product. Remote access view of environment and navigation system. Our client just purchased the property and has been getting a lot of complaints from the neighbors about break-ins, noise issues, and graffiti. Oh, not, you know, just gonna forget about the ghosts and shit. You know, the demons and everything that's throwing chairs around. Try to get a photograph of the culprits. That's pretty much the game. Uh, you have to download, like new softwares for your uh robot and you have to just take pictures of shit it's a pretty cool game man it's just weird as fuck you know what i'm saying like look at this shit man oh yeah and i'm playing window because fucking um full screen just didn't work for me hey rookie i'm barry your dispatcher follow my instructions to make this easier for both of us turn on the generator take a photo of the ca calibration test over the computer okay open crate Wait, what? Where is that? I'm actually gonna turn it up a bit. There we go. That should be good. Okay, uh... Do I have to leave? Do I have to leave? Oh, okay, here we go. And there are the um the controls. I mean, it's pretty uh straightforward. Uh, you just it's it, it'll get it'll get um easier when we go through it. Okay, press E, turn on generator. All right, cool. And that's pretty much what you do, man. You just you go through the game, you do shit, you know, and shit's gonna happen. Like, trust me, random shit's gonna happen, which is very cool in the game, man. Okay, I think I did it. I didn't do it. There we go. I did it. That would like be like on your ass. There we go. Dude, everything is going fine. What the hell? Oh. I forgot my dumb ass that's how the game works you take photos and then you have to upload them I forgot I was sitting there snapping photos back to back like well what the hell man 
you see you see what i mean by like i forgot what to do like i'm telling you i forgot everything not everything i mean i i kind of know how to play the game like you know the robot and shit but you guys are gonna love it man it's a very awesome game oh yeah and the way the like taking the like oh i'm, I'm i don't even want to spoil it man fuck that i'm just gonna oh, i'm just gonna shut my ass up and play the game for you guys april 7th 1936 and one thing i got confused about was whether these notes were like i'm spitting well whether these notes were like in this period of time like in this actual time period or whether it's like um not 2016 i'm saying like in the time period that this note is in or if these are old notes so who knows man finally i've made it up to the cabin my god it's been so long since i've been up the weeds are overtaking the gate I could barely see the numbers. I guess I need to do some serious cleaning before I, I can start writing again. It's good to be back, but I don't know. It. It just feels different somehow. Normally it's so quiet, but those damn crows have been acting up ever since I arrived. They're just birds though, right? Now, I don't know, man, because from what I understand, I believe that bird, not not birds, but crows, well, I mean, they're a bird, but I believe that crows are a death note anyways i added that note to the archive section we need you to confirm that we have the right address take a picture of the address and i did that uh what okay note on gate yeah oh okay okay i get it sorry i'm telling you like it's 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 a little slow right now but you just wait until we get into it you know what i'm saying I believe that's the right address, am I right? Okay, that should be good. Yep, perfect. I've opened up the gate so you can explore the courtyard. Use the first person camera, yada, yada, yada. We get it. All right, see if you can get a photograph of any graffiti. I'm telling you, man, the way the game is set up is just very nice and awesome, man. Especially when shit starts going south. Okay. And is and, and I'm not really used to res, like Resident Evil old style controls, man. The whole tank shit, I'm not used to that one fucking bit, yo. I'm not, not at all, not even close, jabroni. Not even close. It's gonna take me some time to get used to it, but you know, with oh, what was that? Oh, that's fucking freaky. Certain things you can't see unless you go into the first person camera, but you, you guys know what it is, man. Pretty legit, though. I like it. And we're not even in the scary shit yet, you know what I'm saying? And I, I almost forgot, like, all the scary shit. Nicely done, rookie. I can't seem to open the front door, or any of the doors for that matter. Oh, yeah, and if you guys, obviously, if you've been wondering, I believe that the robot is obviously controlled by someone, so that he's calling them rookie. I'm just, I, I just had to put that out there. Can you get a photo of the front door to see if anything is blocking it? Sure, why not, Jabro? There seems to be a wheelbarrow and a shovel blocking it. Ow. Ooh! Ooh! Holy shit. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. I don't remember that one bit. <laughs> See what I mean by shits, random shits happening? <laughs> oh, that got me. Oh, that got me a bit. <laughs> I love the game, man, because it's like shit, shit like this happens, yo. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Lightning strike. That was really strange. All the lights went out. I think the house might have been struck by lightning. Yeah, yeah, le yeah. Let's go with that. The house was struck by lightning. You just did, you didn't see anything that happened on camera. No, it was the lightning strike. I'm sure if that damn house was hit by lightning, that shit would have exploded. But whatever. Yeah, at least I can open the front door now. However, the hallway lights seem to be out. Check out the hallway and take a photo of any evidence. And I honestly don't know like how long these chapters are because. When I was recording the first time, it seemed to be going on forever, man. And I honestly don't want to record an hour-long video. That would take too fucking long to go up. 
but we're in the house. You see, it looks exactly like a Resident Evil game, man. It's awesome. It's very awesome, man. Very awesome. Until shit starts talking to me. It's weird because I'm a robot. You know, you usually get the sense of, like, playing as a a person in these type of games. But it's, you know, you would What? You wouldn't expect the... Oh, my God. It was, <laughs> this is good to me. You wouldn't you wouldn't really expect a robot to be afraid of anything because robots don't really have feelings, but eh, it's a cool game though. April fourteenth, nineteen thirty six. Maybe I'm just wound up. I don't know. I haven't felt the moment's peace since I arrived. This place is normally a sanctuary, but I just can't seem to get settled. I've barely written a page in a week. For Christ's sake. I was just walking to the kitchen to get some more tea and I nearly dropped my teacup when the door slammed shut. The wind, the w wind, the wind does play tricks up here sometimes. I'm sure that's all it was. I have to get those windows sealed before something gets in. Alright. Alright. Wait, turn around, turn around, turn around. Oh, fuck. It's, it's weird playing as, uh, playing in window mode. That is so weird. The hallway lights came on when you took a picture of that note. Must be a coincidence. Oh yeah, you see what you see what scientists do. Now I'm not trying to make this into an argument, but they're like, oh, you take a picture of a note, lights come on. You know, it's like, come on, bro. Keep looking around while I try to figure this out. Whatever you say, guy. Whatever the fuck you say. It's weird. Come on, turn around. There we go. There we go. It's 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 weird playing as a a robot. You know what? Okay, we're good. We're good. I think that was over here. Yeah. See, I kind of remember certain things, but at the same time, I don't. It's Almost, almost, ain't shit. Oh no, you're supposed to. I swear, man, these controls. I'm not. Oh, must be the wind. Those look like the light orbs. A common issue with our cameras. We're working on a software fix for that. Oh, they think they can fix everything. Oh my god. Looks like the wind slightly opened the Oh, it, it looks like the wind slightly opened the door and closed it repeatedly. Wow, wind works like that, doesn't it? Monitor the living room and take a photo of any evidence. Alright. Oh, it's dark as fuck. I swear. It's dark. It's dark. I got the chills. Yo. What is that? Oh, it's shadows. Oh my god, yo. Oh, I got the chills like a bitch. Okay, there's a note over here. Just gonna take a picture of you. April 17th, 1936. Finally started to feel like normal again. For a little while anyways. I guess I drifted off for a while and awoke to the sound of those bloody birds. I decided to read my book instead. For some reason, I just couldn't concentrate at all. I flipped through the pages mindlessly. I swear I placed that room a thousand times that night. Paced, not placed. Scoring fine for line for line and word for word. And bear I'm sorry that font that font is weird to me. And barely reading a thing. I remember laughing at the absurdity of it all. What's wrong with me this isn't like me I swear the wind is, is starting to whisper things is that coming in from in there where is that coming from It's like in my right ear, yo. I love how like sound transitions like that. It goes from like one ear to the other, yo. It's awesome as hell. Is that in here? 
Oh, I'm just gonna go out here then. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm just. Where is that coming from? Oh, it's the book. And then it just disappeared. Okay. Lady, uh, you're not really that scary. Wow, that's fucking weird. That's not weird at all, man. It must just be the wind carrying that book and sh moonlight shining those orbs. Neat camera trick, rookie. You made it look like that book is floating. Oh, yeah, because you must be using Adobe After Effects. Oh, my God. Must be the angle you took it from. Version 1.0 is out. Look for, um, look for more suspicious activity while I work on sending you that upgrade. All right. That's the clock from... Uh, Emily wants to play. Okay, gonna go look for some more suspicious activity. What about over here? Cause I know, oh no. Oh wait, 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 that's right there. Yeah. Okay. Just gonna send you a picture of this damn clock. Because the alarm just so happened to go off at the right time. Well, it looks like the next patch update is ready. Okay, orb fix, fish eye lens, full color pictures. Okay, cool. Cool beans. Chapter 2, The Stroke of Midnight. Alright, you know what? I know you guys aren't going to like this, but I'm going to leave it right here. Because I don't want anything to fuck up. But yeah, man, this is this is Shudder. I hope you guys are enjoying this game. It's a very awesome game indeed. I'm really loving it. I just hope everything goes well, and I hope you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Um, and yeah, it saves at each chapter, so we're just gonna leave it here. But um, yeah, man, it's 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 just awesome. You know what I'm saying? Like I know things are happening slow, and I know it's a lot of back and forth, just snap pictures and update, not updating all this, and this guy right here bullshitting with his with his theories and shit of what's going on and what he believes is going on. But once you look past all of that. It's a it's a horror game that really speaks for itself, and I hope you guys will enjoy this journey as we go through it. So leave a like, comment, subscribe um, if you guys are looking forward to the next part, and I will see you guys then. This is your man Stefan signing off, and I will catch you later. I'm out.